everyone welcome to my channel Timmy here I am Timmy and if it's your first time on my channel welcome in today's video I am going to be showing you guys a bunch of products random products in no particular order they are just things I got at different points in time and they came in at one point so I'll be showing you everything so where do I start from I have many of them here already I can either start from Shein if you haven't watched my last Shein video I'll leave the link here I said in that last video that I go on Shein to look for things that are not clothes Mm? and that's what I do almost every month or every twice a month but I know I, I'm always on Shein looking for things that are not clothes I need to get my scissors so I have a bag here worth about 70 pounds worth of things from Shein and I'll be showing you everything although my things came my things from Shein came twice I don't know why they split the order. I feel some some people said you know if the thing or if the item you got is in um, Britain here, you get them in like two or three days, and if it's coming from China, it gets here like a week later. And the reason why I like shopping from Shein is because I know their things are from China, so I like China things. Your iPhone is from China. So I'll be starting from Shein and here we are I need to look for a more feminine way of unboxing and tearing line on This will not pay anybody So I have one of the bottles that came in here previously This is one of the bottles I got It is a plain bottle for juicing of juice bottle it is 35 ml sorry 350 ml what am i saying so it's 350 ml and then um, i want to start juicing i figured out i want to start drinking juice every morning especially citrus e juice like lemon um you know tangerine or clementine with turmeric and black pepper i've been hearing a lot of the good things that he has been doing um on twitter and then on tiktok <clears throat> and i always have severe menstrual cramps i'm literally crippled on some days because of my cramps and people have been testifying to the fact that it helps them with their symptoms whenever they have pms or whenever they're on their period so i want to try it out and then I felt it wouldn't make sense for me to be juicing one, 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 one every day. So it would be good if I just in bulk and put them in bottles and just, you know, have them. People even have shots. I went all the way of ordering a 350 ml because I need more than a shot. My body is big. So yeah, I got this big bottle from Shin. This is 2000 ml, that's 2 liters. I have not even opened it and I am in love. Let me check for the price because I am meant to be putting the price on the screen, right? So I just have to go to my orders and look for how much it costs. Will you believe it's just 7 o'clock and it's dark like this already? I mean, it has been dark since 5 o'clock. So who am I to complain? So this bottle cost nine pounds on chain. Yeah, so it is two thousand ml, and I'm hoping I'm able to drink more water as the day go by. So it's not like I don't have enough bottles. I'm looking at some bottles here already, and I'm like, do I really need this? Yes, I do. I don't have a two thousand. You know, I'll probably take this to the office instead of going back and forth on my office desk. This will be beside me and then, you know, I'll be okay for the day. 
so that's that the next item will be my aura irrigator so i am taking my teeth health very seriously i want to start water flossing i always i don't always floss <laughs> i floss whenever i remember or whenever i am uncomfortable that's when i floss so i want to start water flossing that's why i got this aura one so it is meant to shoot out very very what high or it's really high speed or like very mm -hmm. Hey, off now. Hey, go ignore off. Okay, so it's meant to shoot out water at a high speed that will penetrate into the corners or the spaces in between my teeth and then clean it, clean it for me. So, oh god, it's not opening. I'm meant to open this up and connect the um, one of this. I don't know what's it called. In side okay so this one one of these should go here uh, I I'm going to fill this up with water oh, let me just do it so I'll put this one here this goes here like this and then I'm meant to fill this up with water and here we are so that's how it works wish my teeth good luck so it has weak strong and pulse I'll probably be using the strong one every day of my life until it's spoiled. How much was it? This was £7.50 on Shein. So, um, if you want to try it out, I don't know, I haven't used it before. This is my first time of getting such. Hopefully, I have fun, you know, cleaning my teeth. But yeah, it's called Oral Ir Irrigator. So, this is what it looks like. Next is uh, uh, mobile portable raincoats. Yes, so these are raincoats, and if you ask me why I got them, they looked cute, and I was like a raincoat in a ball that is very handy. Yes, it is. So you open this up and your raincoat is inside. I'm not going to unravel it because I wouldn't be able to fold it back. But at the end of the day, when you know the raincoat spoils or when you are done with it, you still have this case to use for whatever you want to use it for. And it just looked cute. Besides, I'm traveling in two weeks and um, I just felt it might be something I want to have with me when I travel. So I got two portable raincoats and they were £2.75 for both of them next on the list is bonnets oh. whenever I want to go to the African store to buy bonnets they are either selling the £10, £15, £20 like for bonnets and it's not even a black person or a nigerian or an african person i sell it it's asians so i'm like you guys are taking a piece i went to shin of course and ordered bonnet and it came out hey eh, the fabric is kind of very very inferior you know but it's nothing very unsuspected or unusual from machine not to really insult you guys but with clothes it, it, she doesn't do it for me i don't know why but i'm always very very skeptical even 
basically any type of online shopping i'm always very very skeptical about shopping online because of my body type or my body shape so i'd rather buy things that are not clothes from shane so don't worry shane i will still patronize you so this was one pound 25 can you imagine from 15 pounds to one pound 25 mind you i bought two bonnets i uh, where's the second one this is the second one and this one has like a lace or a whatever to tie like this so when you wear this has a better quality and more space than the red one so when, when you put this on you can you know go ahead to tie it at the back and i figured out this would be good if you have a um, lace frontal and uh, you want to secure your frontal you can just hide this part and it's very elastic elasticity and tie it down so and it was um two pound 25 Next on the list are the rest of my bottles. I got five of them. One, two. One, two, three, four. And then the last one. This one came last week. This one. Five of them. So I got five of them. I'll just throw them by the door because it's going to the kitchen. And I was thinking it was going to be way cheaper than me getting them in maybe B and M or Poundland, but one was one pound fifty. And I went to B and M over the weekend, and I found something similar to this, but not the one you can like turn and secure. And that one was um, one pound twenty. So I'm thinking I'll just get one from B and M and just see how everything works and see the one that's best for me, because I plan on getting more bottles, because. I want to be just about 10 bottles at once instead of just five. Next is where is this item? What's this? Oh I got another frother. My last video I got a frother. It was a perfect frother until it wasn't. Why? Because I spoiled it. I put the frother in my bag and pressed it and then this part of it bent and it couldn't bend back so I had to get another one this time around this one has like double double the spin or double the front whatever you want to call it so it has two of it like this so um, yeah and it's bigger and uh, I got two of this one so one is in the office I can have my you know coffee in the office and whenever I choose to make coffee at home i'm keeping this one at home for my home coffee so that's where this came from so it's foam stick i don't know why they're calling it foam stick chinese people foam stick you <laughs> wine you wine me and foam stick was how much was foam stick two pounds 75 this people are not serious so the last one i bought was one pound 50 so i'm guessing because this one is bigger that's why it's more expensive and uh, i got bathroom um you fasten this thing to the wall of your bathroom the one i have on my bathroom right now bro is a long story because i kept going back and forth back i went to be and m like i think four times returning and trying out the bathroom the thing you hang on the wall to put your soap put your sponge your scrub your face wash everything see and nothing you know sat right with me i eventually had to go on shin and of course shin will have it so this is why i tell you i go to shin for everything but clothes where else am i going to find this thing for how much For two pound, two pound eighty, two pound eighty. Eh? I'm going to open this up now. The one I got in my bathroom set that is not working was more expensive, and it came with the one for the wall too. The one you are going to put on the wall. So this is the one you put on your wall. You fasten this to your wall. I think it's the two sides, like this, and then you put it on your wall so you have your oh god i love this already it looks really nice and sturdy 
honestly. Next in our bag is another bottle. If you ask me why I got this, I don't know why. It looks very cute and it was 250ml. I thought this would be for juice also, but I will be carrying this one around with me because it's just so cute. <laughs> it's so freaking cute. <laughs> it looks like cup for baby milk, but I don't care because it's cute. <laughs> oh my goodness, I love it so much. <laughs> And that was two pounds twenty five. Next on the eh, my order is not complete. My order is not actually complete. This is the first time I'm, I'm experiencing this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm getting up to speed. I'll explain. So, I bought... Are you telling me it was one piece? I got this um, tiny pump, LS pump bottles for lotion and for liquid on Shein. So, if you want to like pump foundation or your body cream inside... Can you pump body cream in this? Yes, you can. Inside this, I got one piece. Meanwhile, they advertised three. So I was thinking I was going to get three for £1.75. So I'm just seeing now that it's one piece. And this is 15 ml. I don't even think you have to fill this up because if you are traveling, Ryan hair will not allow you to carry more than 15 ml per this thing. So I'll probably put my body cream no, I don't need to put my body cream in here, but I'll figure out what to put in here. But yeah, this I got this because, as like I said earlier, I'm going on a trip very soon, so I got that. And then I got this tiny um um cream jar, small sample cream jar. I honestly thought I was going to get five. That was what I was saying. My order is not complete. But as I'm seeing one piece now, I'm reading the description and I'm seeing that it's one piece they sold for that price. If I had known that it was one piece, I'd have gotten more of it, honestly. So is this cream jar. This is where I'll be putting like my skincare, my serum and my sunscreen. I don't know if you can see it, but it's very, very tiny. It's like all those small jars for glitter. So I'll put my serum and then... Uh, sunscreen in here. I'm hoping I can quickly order more and it comes on time. So, yeah, what was I thinking? One of it is 70p. So, me expecting five pieces is kind of a shade. And uh, I got bracelets, I love everything that blinks and shine. I got some bracelets. Ooh, I pray you enter my hand. One, one, two, three, and four bracelets. Why do things look different online? I want you to collect them, they look completely different again. Who buy this one? Oh my goodness. I actually bought it. No problem. So all these were what well, this I'll just open them up because um because I need to try them. So this is the first one. This is two pound fifty and yeah, this is my hand. Will it? My hand is big, my hand is very very big, honestly. I'll have to like open it up and try and do something for it to enter my hand. But yeah, my hand is big. I have to struggle with it before it enters my hand so that it doesn't cut. But on a normal day, to enter the average person's hand. But yeah, as I am, <sighs> like a giant, I'll deal with it. 
so this one was two pound fifty and the next one is silver so i have the silver one this one too is equally small i will just rush through this video because i have other things to open one and uh, yeah so that's everything i got i'll try them on later and uh, probably in another video the next thing i'll show you guys is my thermal um bed cover so i got this thermal bed cover for 200 pounds it's winter already or we're entering winter and i love my sleep like i don't joke with my sleep and the last thing i want to do is to be shivering in bed so i got thermal cover i don't know how this works but obviously i'm wearing thermal inside so the same way you know the science of thermal wear keeps you warm i'm hoping it's the same thing with these bed covers i'm not going to open this up because it's big it's from a double bed mind you satin bed spread or bed sheets are the most useless things ever made if you see satin bed spread do not buy it the only thing you should buy in satin is a pillowcase so this is 200 pounds and then i have here um that was my phone new towel that i got so the one i got from primark doesn't clean my body very well i know i don't know if i complained here but yeah it doesn't clean my body properly when it finishes it leaves uh wool all over my body obviously what was i expecting it was cheap it was about 15 pounds so i got this one now from argos for 50 pounds it was 55 pounds but i think i got um i got uh this pound so i got for 50 pounds because it was on sale and uh, it's very woolly the next thing i have here is a duvet cover so this is a cushion duvet cover and very very woolly also this is for a king size um duvet and i got this one for 35 pounds this was 35 pounds duvet cover and this also is going to keep me warm see and if my bed is going to be very cozy by the time i combine all the things i bought because winter and eh, something about winter in these countries you need to make your space feel very very comfortable because outside is very not eh, it's cold it's uncomfortable so when you come in you are expecting to feel warm to feel comfortable and just come home and be cozy you know even without you putting on the heating because obviously putting on the heating is expensive so you just um getting into bed should feel very warm so without a heating blanket or without putting on the heater you should get into bed and feel very you know comfortable so yeah my bed is going to be this winter and of course i got new bed spread so this is sleep and dream obviously sleep and dream uh this is a uh, cream i didn't get white because white might be too much of work and i'm not a white person if I buy white, I end up using it twice and then throwing it away because obviously it's stained and, and I can't deal with the stain. So I got cream, hoping, you know, to be good for me. And this is for a double bed. And uh, this bed spread was for 20 pounds. Was it 20 or 25 pounds? The next on my list is in my last vlog or <laughs> the last last vlog i went to primark to change this um uh, workout tight so i'm deviating from wearing shorts booty shorts or shorts to the gym to wear long leggings or long active wears so this was 10 pounds from primark so i went to change the one i had from xl to large because the xl was too big for me so yeah this was 10 quid 10 pounds i got another active wear also and this one was from i don't know the name i took off the tag and i got this one for 20 pounds oh okay okay it's from 
this is from F and F. I don't know why it was so hard to read, but yeah, this is from F and F, and I absolutely love it because it has this transparent mesh here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah, it has this transparent mesh here all the way down. So yeah, I absolutely love this one. And uh, still on Primark, I <laughs> I got another booty shot. I love wearing shorts to work out. Well, it's getting cold, you know, walking back, because I walk to the gym, walk back and forth. Walking back from the gym is, you know, quite a distance. And my legs can tend to freeze, so I got this for five pounds from Primark. Bro, I love Primark so much. I'm such a Primark girl, bro. You can be dressed head to toe Primark and still look very, very fly than someone that is wearing Zara. So yeah, I got this workout shorts from Primark, and thankfully they are high waisted, and I got them in a size large, five pounds. Next is hair clip because I have braids on, I might be you know styling my hair with hair clip, obviously. And this was two pound fifty. Oh, what do we have next? Oh. Um, I bought a pair of or pairs of Nike socks. This is three pairs of Nike socks and they okay and i got this for i think 18 pounds i'm not sure yeah i got that for 18 pounds i got black pepper hello 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 so i got black pepper because i was told or i heard on twitter that when you're making your juice your your turmeric juice you have to put black pepper in the turmeric because black pepper breaks down the turmeric for your body to digest it. And uh, I got batteries for my microphone. I haven't used my microphone in over a year. It, the last time I used my microphone, well, I said my microphone. <laughs> my microphone was in January last year, 2022. And it messed me up. My audio was butchered from a video, and that was the last time I used the microphone. So I'm hoping, you know, I can redeem the microphone. And I have here a bunch of makeup stuff. Next on my Julia's Place concealer finished. Mind you, this thing did not finish really, really low. I had to like open it up and like I can't tell you the that thing I did for that Julia's Peace Concealer. But yeah, I got a new concealer and I was trying to get Fenty Concealer but I wasn't liking the shades I was seeing. I wasn't liking the undertone. And when I eventually got the one that I liked, I, it was like 12 ml and I was like, okay, for how much? <laughs> Please dear. So I got the Maybelline one instead and this is in the shade 11. Hopefully this is a good shade for my under eye this is 6.8 ml and i got this for 11 pounds so that's my yeah um i got the benefit um blush and i was so excited i started wearing it already so let me just put a little bit a little of this Oh, on my cheek, it has like a shimmery. Oh, <gasps> what? <laughs> Good. I don't know if you show it, but yeah, I like what I'm seeing in the mirror. I love the shimmer it shows because I can't remember the last time I wore bronzer on my cheeks. And this is bringing like the shine back to my cheeks. I'm like, oh my goodness, I missed what my cheeks used to feel like with highlight or illuminator. But yeah, trust me to be drowned in this blush or blusher by tomorrow. I'm going to London tomorrow for a wedding. I'm thinking of, you know, whether I should do a vlog or not. But yeah, one thing I noticed with this blush is that it's leaving the shimmer more than the um, blusher or blush on my cheeks. 
so i'm thinking if i have a cream brush i say brush blush or blusher underneath it can highlight it more let me know if you're seeing a difference i have a little bit of blush here but this is more red than um this pink one so this is the blush i, I have on here is redder than this one this is very pink so let me know if you have seen the difference i'm just seeing a shine in the mirror but yeah i bought the benefit blusher for 20 pounds the next item I have here oh, is uh, I tried out or I've been using the Fenty mascara sample and um, so far so good I have loved it therefore I went to buy the uh, big one like the oil um, basically like Fenty mascara so yeah that's what sample does it gets you to buy the real real deal so yeah i'm using hella thick volumizing mascara that's the mascara i'm using this is 10 ml and this was 18 pounds fenty mascara and i got i was looking for a pink lipstick this is super staving ink lipstick i was looking for a pink lipstick this was what i bro when the spider start flying that looks like mosquito. Whatever. I should kill it now. Because I'm not going to have this. <laughs> so I can't find it again. <sighs> I need to come out. So as I was saying, I got the uh, Maybelline. Uh, Maybelline lipstick and I was looking for a pink lipstick but this was what I could get oh, oh god this is very very not pink I wanted a bright pink but this is not bad if I line it properly with a very good liner probably like a brownish purple liner uh, it can work mm, don't worry and you know gloss it up properly it's actually not bad it's as bright as i want it to be mm, now i'm thinking should i wear this tomorrow i'm not sure please don't look at the stain on my on my shirt thank you very much this is a good lipstick i like it and the last thing i got is this uh, Maybelline filter gloss like I don't have enough gloss so it's the lady who was selling it to me was like you know you have to pair it with a gloss to go and I was like okay give me the gloss so I got this gloss I don't want to put it on my lips because uh, I will stain the brush but uh, what you should know is I got the gloss so this is the gloss I just let's see honestly this is not a bad combination if i can just wear it properly yeah it's really not bad so pairing these two is really not bad but my mind is telling me if i'm going to do this my face has to be properly baked mind you if you're a dark girl i'm a dark girl i'm very dark forget lights camera you know bro look at my look at my hand I mean that girl so if you want to wear like a bright colored lipstick especially red pink you have to make sure your under eye is perfect you can always get away with nude lipstick i'm giving you like a makeup tip in this video i know you can always get away with nude lipstick with anyhow you do your makeup even if you don't have the highlights whatsoever but if you want to wear like a bright colored lipstick as a dark girl your under eye will let you get away with it okay i know my onions so that brings us to the end of this video i don't know if it's over or if it's if this video is worth 500 pounds but i'm pretty sure i know the debit alert i got on my credit card so yeah that brings us to the end of this video i hope you enjoyed it if you need any of these things go on shin if you need any other, other of these things go to boots go to argos I don't think I'll be leaving any links because I went in person to get the makeup and the things on Shane 
wear from Shin. Shin didn't pay me, so I wouldn't do the hassle of posting them in the description box. Right? Thank you everyone for watching this video. I hope to see you in my next one. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, baby. And I'll see you in my next one. Adios. Do you like my lipstick? Pink fits me, Sharon. Actually, this is eventually pink. Maybe it's pink I wanted to buy. <laughs>